Well, we've got a pretty normal day weather-wise here. Temperatures around 50 to start off the day. Temperatures get to the low 70s, and if you're wondering why I'm calling it normal, well, this is really where we should be this time of year. 50 degrees is our average low. 73 is our average high. We weren't quite there yesterday. In fact, we got down to 33 degrees in Greensboro on your Wednesday morning. We only made it into the mid 60s, and even that was an improvement from where we were earlier in the week. So I think we're happy for a return to normal with temperatures continuing to climb over the next couple of days. Here's a look by the afternoon temperatures in the low 70s in the Piedmont. We've got winds 8 to 12 miles per hour. A lot of cloud cover today, but staying nice and dry for us. In the foothills, temperatures get to the low 70s as well. Clouds here and there, but mild with winds 5 to 10 miles per hour. The mountains, a slightly different forecast today. We've got that 20% chance for a couple of showers here and there, and then winds 10 to 20 miles per hour by the afternoon. Temperatures get to the mid 60s, so that's nice. That's a big difference from earlier this week when we had temperatures that didn't make it out of the 40s in the mountains and winds up to 35 miles per hour. Comparatively, this isn't too bad of a forecast, even if it's not as perfect as other spots in our forecast area. Here's a look at our forecast highs. Again, average low 70s. We're making it to the low 80s tomorrow. We're staying there through the weekend into next week. By Monday, we're about 10 degrees above normal. I think a lot of people will be looking forward to that. And not only that, a lot of plants will be looking forward to that. Some warmer temperatures after frost and freeze alerts over the past couple of days. Hopefully your plants survived. Thankfully, we don't have any cool temperatures on the way for the overnights and early mornings over the next few days either. Staying in the 50s, which is kind of that time frame and that temperature range where plants start to thrive in our areas. So some good news all around for our region as far as the temperatures are concerned. We still could end up with another frost this year. It's not entirely over, but we're getting close to the end. We're not getting close to the end of pollen season quite yet though. Tree pollen is still high today. Grasses and weeds are low. Grasses are right on the border of low and medium though. So no matter what, you want to take that allergy medication before you head outside to enjoy these warmer temperatures. Tree pollen expected to stay high through the weekend as well. So no matter what you're doing, to enjoy the 80s allergy medication necessary. Here's a look at your seven day forecast. Our next rain chance arrives on Tuesday. It looks like we'll have quite a bit of rain and also quite a bit of wind on that day. All right. Thank